How's it going, my trim people? Dr. Slacking the Slacking Doctor back with week seven, I think. Pretty sure it's week seven of the NCP as this week your uh, Cotswold Whimsicots go up against Emil and his uh, Montreal Scaroopies. Now, I have no idea how this one's going to go. You can see his team next to me. He basically uh, did something I was kind of considering doing this season, so, but a little bit different. He basically drafted until he had, I think, 69 points left over for the meme. I was considering doing something uh, a little bit similar with the draft, not not uh, leaving 69 points for the meme, but doing a similar kind of very low budget draft um, for, for a different kind of idea though. I won't get into it because I might I might still do this at some point, but anyway. Um, so, oh, I just realized I shouldn't have that on. Hopefully the audio wasn't all fucked up. Uh, I'm just gonna drop him a good luck, have fun. So, in theory, his team sucks because he used less less than half the budget, I think. Uh, it was a very bad uh, team on paper. However, annoyingly, the few half-decent things he has match up quite well against me. So, all right, I brought fucking Defog for the first time in my life for no good reason because I was worried about Shuckle. Um, and there's a fucking Porygon. Thought there could be, to be fair. Uh, and there's a Lilligant instead of who? No, Dusk Noir. Amazing. I was quite worried about Dusk Noir. Okay. That's good. That's good. I mean, Lilligant probably sweeps me. You know, so there's that. But good shiny Gen 5 Sprite there, Lilligant. Good work. Um, you'll still know Whimsicott, but you'll do. I've got no time at all. Um... I think Zabuzali is pretty solidly versus everyone, right? I don't really see a bad lead for Zabuza. Without the Dust Noir especially. Yeah. So yeah, good luck, have fun to my opponent. Um, is the audio okay? Mine sounds kind of crackly. Is your audio crackling? There's a lag on the audio, isn't there? Yeah. All right, we'll turn that audio off because it's crackly and laggy. Uh, once again, we have no audio because basically I was playing Football Manager while I was waiting for him and I've discovered that's the problem. If I play Football Manager while I wait for people, the audio gets fucked. So uh, yeah, can't be doing that. Don't really want to get uh, will o wisp here, which I think is a possibility. But surely you fear Scarf. Right? Surely. I'm just going to U-turn. Surely you fear Scarf. As the Drapion comes out, so I really wish I Drain Punched slash Surging Strike. Sorry about no audio. I mean, is there something I can do to give us some audio in the background here? Um, I think I just took a Rocky Helmet. Yeah, I did. Okay. As I'm trying to get some music on in the background for us, you know, get a bit of something going in the background. Um, I was just thinking, he doesn't, his ground resist is Lilligan, but do I want to let Lilligan potentially set up? Because I am Scarf, so, um, but I know he's not Choice, and I know he's not Shooker, so this should just kill. Um, but I was just debating, is that a, a wise move? Um, but I'm adamant, I imagine I'll do quite a lot to a Lilligan, barring like a physically defensive Lilligan. So, I think this is fine. Um, should we try and get some music going? Enchanted ASMR Ambience. That sounds terrifying. I don't think I want to go for that. I'll go for this. Oh! You couldn't hear that. I just got a really loud advert in my ears. That is so loud. I'm worrying my internet's disconnected, so it's not even going to last. Oh my god. So much happening here for me. Oh my god. Uh, okay, so we did about... We did a fuck ton to that loud for us. Did we crit? I wasn't paying attention. I was trying to get music. All right, don't blame me. Don't, don't you blame me. I'm going to go Zabazar because I think, you know, we see an ice move come out and it's worst case scenario is freeze dry. I want to keep this thing healthy. 
I don't want to get ice sharded. Um, taking hits with that could be important later in the game. So, as he doubles potentially into the Lilligan. Yeah, okay. Um, but we will take any hit from this thing and we can U-turn out. Could drain punch, but I don't think I want to just yet. I think I just want to U-turn. Drapier comes back out. We're going to take more Rocky Helmet Chip, but I'm okay with this at the moment. I'm okay with this. I know I'm losing HP on, on that and it sucks, but it is what it is. Um, am I willing to lose my Helmet on Stargazer to get Rocks up at this point? Yeah. Yeah. Because he'll go Lil again the next time on the Crook, so I won't get as much benefit out of that. But getting rocks up could be really, really useful for, for wearing down this fucking thing. So I'm going to get a Stealth Rock off. I think that's the way to go from this point. What was I doing? Oh yeah, I was trying to reconnect myself to the internet so that we could have some music. <sighs> this is just stressful. I have no idea if we crit the Lapras or not. Um, oh, it does actually have the Taunt. That's incredibly annoying. You don't stay in, so what, you go Lilligan. Do I have a play that covers Lilligan and him staying in? Kanye. I still need that for Ente. No, not really. I just don't want Aegis to get sleep powdered by the Lilligan. I don't think you stay in. I don't, I don't think you stay in. So I'm going to be really aggressive. As the Porygons comes out, okay. So obviously going to be able to trace my static. Um, what do you want to go for on me? Toxic tri attack, mm, probably toxic. So I'm going to go Monty. I imagine this thing was built to try and do something to Monty, but I don't know what. Yeah, Toxic comes out, but I was designed to take advantage of you, so let's get a sub off. This should do nothing while I'm in blade form. Oh, while I'm in shield form, sorry. Okay, perfect. Uh, oh, I haven't turned the audio on for you guys. I've got music. It's lovely. I'm having a great time. I forgot to unmute it for you. Terribly sorry. Do you, oh my god, it's gonna be really loud. Quick, turn it down. Can you hear that? Is that a lot louder than me? The bars are. Oh shit, I need to watch the timer. Um, gonna King's Shield. Uh, yeah, I didn't really want to because I just felt like it was a free switch for him, but. So he can. He can. Knock off, I could King's Shield. I'm just gonna uh, flash cannon here because I think that's really valuable. Like, if I can catch him, he's slower than me. He's Whirlwind, he's Whirlwind. Okay, so I'm glad I didn't go for the King's Shield because I was like, there's gonna be like some kind of taunt or status or something that will go through King's Shield if you didn't know. That music looks too loud, so I'm gonna turn it down a bit more. Hopefully, it hasn't been drowning me out. Um, and that does big, big damage as I get Whirlwinded out. So. I'm super happy to have given up 25% on my Age of Slash in return for wearing this thing down. Um, the taunt makes that very annoying. And he could Earthquake here. Unfortunately, Stargaze is my play. I don't like it. Um, I don't know if I'm faster than him, and I'm, I don't want to find out the hard way, so. I'm going to take my water absorb again. Oh, sorry, this time. Um, he could just opt to foul play here. He could opt to toxic here. I think I value my rocks enough to let this thing get toxic, and we could see him, you know, try and make uh, over predict on the... Because um... what do I need this for? 
Yeah, I could see. I was gonna say I could see him trying to catch the um, the Aegis Slash potentially. Although I don't know if Lapras is necessarily the Aegis Slash switch, so maybe I'm wrong there. Okay, did he bring the Dedene? Was that there? Yeah. Um, I'm gonna go straight back to Zabuza. Resist anything but a free dry and with our assault vest. We Depending on how offensive this thing is, we might take on. Um, and I just don't really have great switches to this, so um, I'd rather the thing that's already getting chipped down continue to get chipped down. As the Hydro Pump comes out, we should be able to take it reasonably well. Yeah, we do. We do. And we can Drain Punch now. We can Drain Punch now. I wish I'd Drain Punch sooner, maybe. Nah, I think it's okay. I think it's okay. I'm so tired. So this morning I got up early. Shout! I got. I woke up actually early. I've not been very well to be honest with you. The past couple of days I've been feeling quite, quite unwell, quite unwell. So kill for Stunfisk. There you go, Stunfisk. Um, yeah, I've been, that's why I just valued those rocks there. Um, so yeah, I've not been feeling 100% recently. Um, I'm gonna take this thing because that's the Draco switching. So. Um, yeah, I want this. That's the Draco immunity, and I think I'll live one. So, if he, he turns into like Lapras to get the War Absorb or something, that could be funny. Um, nah, mate. Nah. Um, Tadene does not scare me out. <laughs> I guess this is some cheap pouch bullshit. I don't fucking know. I'm not a Tadene. Expert. Although I did use it once against a team of all flying types against Sean, and it did really well in that game. So, if you, as long as you can run Dedene against all flying types, it's sensational. Um, truly elite Pokemon. So he's going to get a little bit back here, but I do have the Aqua Jet, so I think we're fine. Even though he's got whatever he's just got, I don't fucking know. He actually did manage to live that, which is kind of impressive, Dedene. Good work. Good work. Um, shame you're dead anyway. So. Yeah, I got, I've, been, I've not been well, so I woke up, I'm sp I was supposed to get up at uh, 20 to 8 this morning, half 7, 20 to 8, and I ended up getting up at 7am, so pretty early, um, and then I've just literally been like doing like washing, putting clothes away, tidying up, then I was reading interviews with Hayao Miyazaki this afternoon, um, making notes, emailing my supervisor about my PhD, about um, an essay that I sent him recently, um, and a bunch of questions I had about that. Um, so it's just been like, yeah, just, oh, wrong one. Uh, it's just been a really, really busy day. And then I ended up going to the gym again this evening. So I'm tired. I'm really tired. Uh, I'm just going to drain punch. I don't think, I don't see why I need this anymore. Um, and I, um, yeah. And I, I didn't want this to like sleep powder or quiver dance or some bullshit that I didn't want it to do. So I just clicked drain punch. You saw, you were here, you witnessed firsthand. Ah, okay. So, it seems as though Aegis Slash would be fine. I have Kanye. Uh, the Aqua Jet feels really valuable. More than Monty? Maybe, yeah. Alright, we're gonna go Monty. Uh, now that I've seen... Oh no! No YouTube! That is so loud in my ears! Get that advert out of here, you... Did you hear that? I assume you, you did. That was very loud in my ears. I don't know how loud it was for you, but it was far too loud for me. Um, in fact, the background audio looks too loud for you still. I keep turning it down. You probably can't hear a fucking thing. Probably can't hear a fucking thing. All right. Uh, we're just going to flash cannon here. We've seen that it's slow. Yeah, once I saw what this thing set was, like, I know I said, I don't want to go Age Slash and let him quiver dance or, or sleep powder or whatever. But he revealed a little bit of his set there with the whole leftovers Giga Drain. It's like, okay, this doesn't feel like it's some sunny day weather ball. Uh, solar beam bullshit or something like that. I think this thing gets chlorophyll, right? So, because he has this team where it's like all low pointers, you're you, you're constantly like, what 
what shenanigans has he got going on that could fuck me? And uh, so yeah, that's that's what that's what was was troubling troubling me. Um, I don't remember if we outspeed this or not. Because in blade form, I think I have to king's shield here. Which gives him a free switch into Entei, which I dislike, but or a free recover, but I think that's fine. I think my play is to King's Shield. You can see like a Thunder Wave come out from him. But I don't think I can afford to sub if if well I can't. My sub wouldn't stay up anyway if he foul plays. Obviously my fa uh, the the King's Shield drop will do nothing to his foul play damage. Uh yeah, as he makes like Yes, I agree with his play. But I'm fine with him doing that. That doesn't really inconvenience me in any way. Um, I'm actually just going to Toxic this turn. So that if he switches into Entei on the sub, I don't just give up 25% for nothing. Um, as he foul plays, and he is faster than me. Who doesn't love sub Toxic Age Slash? Comment down below why you are delighted that I brought some bullshit again. I, 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 I'm starting to think that I might be toxic. I'm starting to think that I might not be a good influence in this community. That I may have some traits that make me, let's say, less than desirable. I'm going to sub. He might try to make a switch reading the King's Shield. Which is why I've gone for the sub. Because it's really a no drawback play. I had enough HP to get the sub up. I could King's Shield afterwards even if he attacked. Now, where this will be a drawback play, I thought about Toxicking again, but then I got nothing out of it. At least this way I get a sub out of it. He knows my full set. So if this is sub Entei, that would suck. But because Eric used to fuck me over with sub pressure store Toxic Entei. That man, what a prick. He used to do that to me all the time. But nowadays, now that like... Boots are in the game. No one's running leftovers Entei, so I no longer fear pressure stall Entei like I used to. Um, so, yeah, this is just a good sequence of events. King's Shield seems free. Uh, do I want to be that gross? Yeah, I do. I do, actually, as it happens, as it transpires. I do feel like being disgusting. I feel gross. And that is partially because I haven't showered since I got back from the gym. But also, you can tell by my hair, look, look what's going on here? What is this? It's just a mess. It, I, oh, it's just disgusting, isn't it? I'm terribly sorry. This is not the content that you come to the Dr. Slacking channel expecting. You expect a, a f offensive videos no offensive battling with lots of attacking plays and uh do you i mean i am the man that used weather protect stall versus root and um was described by onesie Burnett the other day as a known hacker a known hacker i am a known ha i'm so good at this game it's actually scary sometimes how good i am um elite in fact elite so, just going to scold because if Lilligant comes in, it's no draw by play really, isn't it? And if he stays into attack again, he'll miss. Because despite having a fantastic shiny Entei, you're a 3D model. And if we look down at the bottom of the screen where I'm about to remove you from, we can see that you looked better as a 2D sprite. Actually, Entei's 3D model is one of the better 3D models. And it's shiny is just elite. But not as elite as my gameplay and training of my Volcanion because this boy despite being as thick as a badger is as agile as a gazelle as uh, cunning as a fox and as Mm. Disease ridden as a koala. You didn't see that one coming, did you? No, fucking surprised you there. You thought I was being predictable. Oh, cunning like a fox. Oh, everyone says that. That's a metaphor or a simile, in fact, that I'm used to. But you weren't expecting as whatever the fuck I just said before. I forgot already. What am I talking about? Where am I? Who am I? What's going on? Who are you? Uh, okay. 
We'll go Kaiman. Uh, toxic or foul play doesn't really matter to us. And we can potentially just get the Moxie Sweep going. Yeah, the foul play is going to bounce. And I think that's a GG. Perfect. I think that's a GG. I think that's how we do it. I think that is how you hack a man who spent less than half his budget on his draft. You hack him to oblivion. And you do it with no remorse. Do you know why? Because I've heard rumours that he's French-Canadian. And that's only one word away from being French. And therefore, it is my duty. <laughs> As a politically incorrect <laughs> British man... From the Isle of Brexit. <laughs> I'm so tired. Uh, to put this heathen. This French speaking heathen. I like him a lot. Please don't um, kick me from the community. From being a filthy, stally, haxery, uh, uh, racist. Uh, can you be French to the racist? Uh, can you be French to the racist? Can you be French to the racist? Can you be racist to the French? I think not. I think they eat far too much cheese to just cheese create immunity to to uh, to abuse. Maybe I don't know. I don't eat much cheese because I was born with a dairy allergy, and that's what it means to be British. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. Blender policy, Lapras. Ooh. Blizzard sing? I don't know. We 6 owed him. I didn't realise. That feels rude. Sorry. I, I was not paying that much attention. That feels rude. We hacked him out. We didn't deserve it. Uh, but for Winston Churchill, who 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 was racist, um, so maybe not for him. For cheese? Uh, dairy allergies. For the Queen? We won. I don't fucking know what I'm talking about. I'm going to bed now. I've had enough. Good night. Thank you so much for looking around with me. And I'll catch you again next time.